It really is a sight to behold. Jets of water shooting up into the air here at Oval Beach. But what are these strange formations called ice volcanoes? For that, I turn to the locals. You're never really sure when they're going to happen or when they're going to melt and really how they get here. Uh, my theory is that it's waves that sort of freeze in midair. That's Douglas City Councilman Jerry Donovan, who says getting to see these up close is as good of a reason you'll find to come to the beach in the dead of winter. Photographer Heather Kennedy loves the beach in winter. It's given her some of her best pictures, including this one. When you see a good sunset, especially this time of year, they, we don't get a lot of them, so you take advantage of them, and um, it was there, so I seize the opportunity. This is definitely one of my favorites just because it is such a cool phenomenon. A self-proclaimed weather nerd, Kennedy says ice volcanoes form when layers of ice build up on the beach. Crashing waves come in, the water finds the weak point in the ice, and of a spectacle to see them. You don't get to see them very often. Winter's cold, but it's beautiful. Even if capturing these moments isn't always the most comfortable, Kennedy says it's her calling. I think it's important that, you know, everybody get to see that because I'm blessed to be able to go do this. I want to be able to share it with other people. To see some of the other amazing images like this one that Kennedy has captured over the years, you can find a gallery on our website, wwmt.com. In Sagatuck, Sam Neff, News Channel 3.